Although it is possible to quit the habit of smoking, many people cannot actually do so for certain reasons. This failure to quit makes us understand that the difficulty of quitting is not caused by serious and painful symptoms resulting from quitting, but this whole process depends on what is going on in the human mind, especially the psychological aspect of it. Perhaps the most dangerous thing that leads a person to stick to this smoking habit is fabricating and finding justifications. For example, when the smoker says that the cigarette makes him focus greatly, relax or feel very happy. And whenever the level of fear of losing these things and beliefs increases, the desire to stick to this smoking habit also increases. The most dangerous aspect of all this is that the smoker focuses on what he loses and at the same time reduces the damage and the number of the risks that smoking causes, such as the incurable diseases, like, lung cancer. But in spite of all these fears, we find that what happens when someone quits smoking is. After 20 minutes, blood pressure and pulse return to its normal state. After 8 hours, the oxygen in the blood returns to its normal state. After 24 hours, carbon monoxide dissipates. But to remember, the process of quitting smoking depends on what goes on in the human mind, specifically the psychological aspect of it.